This is my David Fisher inspired bull mule. At this time, um, I basically followed his directions and his plans that are on the website for David D. Fisher, no, David F. Fisher dot com. The only thing that I changed was the headstock, the upright by the seat area, which I'll show you. I just made it removable with a wedge. So if we come in here, get a couple of different views. Then to get the headstock off so I can add other apparatus, it's just a matter of removing this wedge. And then the headstock pops out. And that's what the headstock looks like. See how I have a couple of inches in here that allows me to have a seat for my other pieces to fit into if I need to. I got a couple of half inch holes that I can bolt things in place if I need to, along with all the half inch holes for the adjustment for the dumb head. The only thing I'm missing at this time is some one by sacrificial material that goes along the top edge so that if you hit it with a tool, you're not damaging the two by eights. You're uh, damaging material that you can easily replace. And that's where I am at this point.